What Blarney offers to people, whether you're from two miles away or from 4,000 miles away, is all the very best of Irish product. In 1928, uh, the founder of Blarney Woolamans, Christy Kelleher, got his first job, which was in O'Mani's Mills here in Blarney. And Christy worked here from 1928 to 1951. Unfortunately, by 1973, O'Mani's Mills went out of business. Christy was a very loyal Blarney man. He saw the tourists uh, coming to Blarney for the castle and leaving. Unfortunately, Christy wasn't in a position to buy or to rent a shop. Um, so he took the unique step of building one himself, which was a thatched cottage on wheels, which he wheeled from his house. That thatched cottage still sits on our grounds here today, and it was essentially the first Blarney Woolen Mill shop. Christy looked back on the days when he worked here, and there was a thousand people working here. It was a hive of activity, and essentially without the mills, uh, life was very difficult in Blarney for the locals because it was such a significant employer, there was no alternative. But Christy was never a man to give up, and his dream was to own the mills here. So between himself and his seven children, um, he managed to raise the money by a variety of different methods. So here we are in the Aran department, and one of the things we pride ourselves on is the exclusivity of our design. It's a great place, a lot of, lot of fun, and um, you have the crystal and you have plenty of woolens, so it's very nice. This is our Blarney Celtic Jewellery Department, and it has the largest selection of Celtic jewellery in any store in the world. I bought jewellery. No, yeah, definitely, it's a good place to shop. It's always the same, people on holidays, people on vacation, people enjoying themselves, and it makes it a wonderful place to work. And that is essentially what Blarney is. It's, it's a very unusual mix of the very local with a very international customer base.